We look forward to seeing that. All right, hey, let's take you outside right now. Live look at the Emota Center lit up here, of course, for uh, the first round of the NCAA tournament. Last check at PDX, 39 degrees with a light breeze and the cloud cover building in. Those clouds eventually will yield some rain. Not a lot of rain, but at least a few showers in our forecast a bit later on. You can see the lion's share of this moisture is still headed towards western Washington, but we will get clipped with that later today. And future cast shows that a little smattering of green on the map by lunchtime. How festive. Going into the afternoon, light showers uh, on and off through the evening hours tonight. That system will pass, and I think as we fast forward into tomorrow, most of Friday looks like a dry day, and with some sun breaks, we could see temperatures climbing up to near 60. So Friday may actually wind up being a pretty nice day. Friday night and Saturday looks wet, potentially really wet, with maybe upwards of a half an inch of rain in the Willamette Valley. All right, the plan for today, again, lots of clouds now. Clouds eventually yielding some spotty to scattered showers this afternoon with temperatures inching their way into the lower 50s. Our seven day forecast here shows a rainy Friday night, early Saturday, and then a cool weekend with lowering snow levels just in time for the arrival of spring on Sunday. Shortly thereafter, we get some spring like warmth. Look at that highs flirting with 70 perhaps Tuesday and Wednesday of next week. We'll be right back.